me. You really <laughs> deserved it, believe me. Sorry for the delay. I'm talking about the 2,000 year delay. <laughs> <laughs> we're a little off schedule. But we're back home, ladies and gentlemen. Yay! Yay! And it's unbelievable. It's just magnificent. There's nothing like it in the history of, ma of mankind. That a, a people leaves its homeland and returns to its homeland. There's nothing like that. Not after 2,000 years, not even after 20 years. Any other nation that left its homeland did not return, was erased from the face of the earth. And there's nothing more great than the fact that after 2,000 years, the Jewish people came back home to their homeland, renewed the language, the culture, the word of God, the geographical places where we have the same names. It's unbelievable. There's nothing more great than that. Actually, there is one thing more great than that. Amen. The fact that this whole process is described word by word in the book. Amen. God says, I'm going to scatter you around the world. And then he said, I'm going to bring, wherever you are, I'm going to bring you back home to here. To the land I promised your, your forefathers. And here we are. It's just unbelievable. You know, we take things for granted. Every morning we get, we get up, we think it's, 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 it's for granted. We not only take it for granted, if our cell phone doesn't work, we can't make a call to you to, to Australia. We think, oh, no, uh, don't take things for granted. And this land is not something we should take for granted. And the whole fact that we came back home is just unbelievable. You know, sometimes I used to be a tour guide. I used to ask my, my Christian groups, tell me, why did you come to here? And they would say, listen, it's the only place in the world where you can open the book and walk in the footsteps of what was. You can go visit the Mount Carmel and see where Ilya said. You can go see the gate of, of En Gedi and follow in the footsteps of King David. You can go to Abraham in the footsteps of Jerusalem. You can go to Jeremiah. You can go, you can go see whatever happened here. Listen, you guys, you missed the whole thing. It's not the only place in the world where you can see what was. It's the only place in the world where you can see it happening. The words of the book come out of the book, materializing and becoming reality. When Isaiah said that all the nations will be coming to Jerusalem, he was even speaking about Texas. <laughs> <laughs> and he said they're going to be coming to hear the word of God. When he said that, all the nations were idol worshippers. And look what's happening. Way before he said it, way before Jesus was born, way before Muhammad was born, he said the world will be coming to hear the word of the one and only God and calling in the name of the one and only God. And look what we have here. And if I would tell you uh, 50 years ago that there would be Christians around the world supporting Israel. And look what we have here. Millions of Christians around the world who are supporting Israel. So ladies and gentlemen, in the name of the people of Israel, in the name of the Israeli parliament, I want to tell you, you people have no idea how significant this visit is for us. And how we, you know, sometimes in the media we get the feeling that we don't have as many friends around the world as we would like. It's so great to see how many friends we have around the world. And each and every one of you, you should be, that, that is for me, I'll, be, I'll, I'll run away and come back in five minutes. Yeah. But each and every one of you, should be a menorah in the flame, a flame in the menorah of God to bring His word to each and every one of your friends, your relatives, your neighbors. And when you go back home, you should know you're a different person. You visited the land chosen by God, given to the people chosen by God, and actually, you have a personal interest. Because God said, whoever blesses us, go get blessed. So you're, you get, you know, it's a win-win situation. I'll be back as soon as I vote. I'll be, I'll be to be continued. Don't go anywhere after the, after the, after the advertisement. <laughs> 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 <laughs>